Using the Wombat Porta Paint to make your painting projects go faster, easier, and safer. Hi, my name is Maya, and I'm going to show you how the Wombat Porta Paint works. Watch Maya while I describe some of the features that make the Wombat Porta Paint such a revolutionary advance in painting. The Wombat Porta Paint kit comes with a number of important and helpful accessories. One of these is the Pro Style Grid for grooming your paint roller. Give it a slight bend so it fits firmly in the tabs inside the porta paint. Also included is an adjustable shoulder strap. It's designed to loop over your shoulder. Slip the strap into the two clips on the back rim of the porta paint. We call the back rim the grip lip. The clips will firmly hold the porta paint so you can hang it at your side, leaving both of your hands free. Whenever you want to remove the porta paint from the shoulder strap, just slide the strap out of the clips. Leave the strap on your shoulder. It's out of the way, but easy to slip back on the clips when you want to use it later. Here you see Maya holding the porta paint with its ergonomic grip. Try it and you'll see how comfortable it is. Just put your thumb over the handle and your fingers under the grip lip. The grip lip has a number of other advantages. Use it to hang the porta paint on the back of a chair, on a drawer, or on a cabinet door. You can also hang the porta paint by the handle on a doorknob. Also included in your porta paint are two very powerful rare earth magnets, one in each of the sidewalls. The magnets will hold your brush firmly in place inside the porta paint, ready for use. At the front of the porta paint is a small lip and channel. Use that lip to groom your brush. Any excess paint will flow back into the pail, not over the side. You can also use the magnets to secure tools on the outside of the porta paint. For example, a scraper. The logo medallion on the red lanyard will hold a roll of masking tape in place. Just drop the medallion through the slot and it will stick right to the magnet. That medallion is also handy for opening a can of paint. The Porta Paint is engineered to use today's efficient mini rollers. They hold almost as much as the old style fat rollers, but fit easily into corners and tight spots. Mini rollers are handy for cabinets and other confined spaces, but also do a great job on walls. You can paint all the way to the ceiling and into the corners with no need for a brush follow up. Today's mini rollers are also much less prone to splattering that means less time cleaning up. With their lightweight, agility, and remarkable paint capacity, you'll find you're actually painting faster. The ladder hook is included with your porta paint and clips to the handle and lets you hang the porta paint securely and easily on a ladder, the top of a door, on a hinge, or many other places. When you're not using the ladder hook, slide it into one of the holes on the rim of the porta paint and place the clip against the side magnet. The slot on the front of the porter paint can hold your cleaning cloth. And these two pockets are for painter's putty to take care of those little holes that often show up while you're painting. All around the rim are slots and holes to hold a scraper, screwdriver, pencil, awl, pliers, tape measure, and any other tools that you want to have at hand. This will save you time, steps, and trips up and down the ladder. The optional lid fits tightly to the porter paint to store your paint roller and brush overnight or for a couple of weeks. Be sure to start pressing the lid in place at the lower front of the porta paint, not at the top near the grip lip. Slide the tab on the lid to fit around your roller handle. Two T-shaped slots on the grip lip let you store the optional tight sealing lid out of the way but ready for use when you need it. You can also snap the optional hip clip into holes in the grip lip. The hip clip slides securely into the belt loop as an alternative way to hang the porta paint at your side. If you like, you can snap the porta paint strap around your waist to hold the belt loop. The optional porta paint liners and rim can make color changes and clean up quick and easy. The liners are custom designed for the porta paint. Here are a few tips on how best to use them. Take your grid and slide it into the liner along the long edge. Turn it sideways to open the liner. 
Slide the liner and grid into the porta paint, fitting the bottom of the grid into the retainer slots inside the pail. Push the bottom of the liner to the sides of the porta paint and fold the top over the rim on all four sides. Now pour your paint into the pail. Next, secure the rim in place. It fits just like the lid. Here again, start by pressing it in place at the lower front of the porta paint and work your way up to the grip lip at the rear. You'll notice that with the liner and rim in place, you can still use the lid to store your paint, roller, and brush. The rim also includes a handy brush grooming lip. The rim will hold your liner securely in place. Hanging at your waist, the porta paint lets you work quickly and easily. But you can always place it on the floor for use with a roller handle when you're using your mini roller to paint large surfaces. Did you know that OSHA, the Federal Occupational Safety and Health Administration, requires you to have both hands free when you're climbing a ladder? With the porta paint, both of your hands are free to carry ladders and other equipment and you can safely climb a ladder. Use the ladder hook while you're working, then slide the porta paint back onto the shoulder strap or into the hip clip. Now both your hands are free again to climb down the ladder. It's the professional, safe way to work. After you've finished painting or when you change colors, the liners again make your work easier. Remove the rim, slide out the grid, then pull out the liner. Hold the liner over your paint bucket. Make a small snip at the corner of the liner and squeeze the paint back into the bucket. It takes you just seconds to dramatically reduce paint waste. Of course, you can always have the liner in place if you're taking a break for a few hours or a few days. Just press the lid in place, open the slot for your roller handle. Now everything inside, your roller, brush, and paint will stay clean and ready for use when you go back to work. When you want to wash out your porta paint, it fits easily in a standard kitchen sink. Here are a couple of tips. If you want to give your porta paint extra protection, such as in a van or truck, it fits perfectly inside a standard five gallon bucket. It's great for holding hand tools and today's compact, powerful battery operated drills and screwdrivers. Thanks for your interest in the Wombat Porta Paint. If you have comments, questions, or suggestions, please contact us at info at portapaint.com or call us toll free at 855 5 Wombat. Thanks for watching. Enjoy your painting.